Hi, this is Null Inquisitor. These days I was very busy with Brigade Con and writing and editing for a special project called RPGS, an acronym for RPG Super Setting. And now I have some free time to do more videos. But today something arrived in the in the mail and I wanted to show you something very special to me. It is finally arrived, RPGS, in Dead 3 format. I cannot tell you how much excited am <laughs> I am about this. So, uh, I've ordered through uh, and I set up the, uh, the printing process through a company called lulu.com and it's very easy, you upload your PDFs and you uh, you you make up a uh, cover for uh, your project using their uh, online tool. So um, I'm very very pleased with these and the people of the project will uh, now be uh, able to uh, to order some. So uh, the uh, soft cover version is um, color exterior and it has a black and white interior so uh, I'm going to recalibrate here so uh, the print is really good the dot pitch is superb it's pretty much uh, the quality of uh, modern uh, printing my uh, only complaint with this type of printing is that the machine is uh, sometimes giving you uh, not a perfect bleed uh, in the end. And I don't know if there is uh, a way to uh, to correct this. Maybe I could uh, bump up my uh, my uh, background in the, in the PDF, but I don't know if it would it will work. Uh, the print is a solid black print. There is some slight uh, printing uh, error, but very slight. Most of the 99% of the product is really uh, clean, easy to read. The font I've chosen, I've chosen for uh, the project make it very easy to read. Plus I added uh, some <laughs> some uh, fun art through. Um, another maybe a little complaint I have with this version of the product is that uh, on the map uh, you can probably not see very well but there is some X's and you can you can you can you can read the uh, the numbers on the on the X's depending on the light lighting but apart from that this is a pretty good book and this is the uh, art uh, art art back uh, version this one is in full color, so the uh, printing process and machine is probably not the same as the other one. So it's a solid uh, cardboard uh, with a shiny finish, very slick. It is kind of hard, <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> so I'll give you an idea. And the interior is, of course, a full color. So this is like. It is a victory to have this in my hand. I work so much for it. Uh, I'm the guy who made it possible, but without any uh, collaborator, th th this would be a, a, a ten-page document, <laughs> pretty much. So, uh, so the project is still uh, open for you to have in a PDF format, so you can uh, go online. I will have the link in the in the notes above the, uh, below the video. Um, you can have this in uh, PDF format for free. This is uh, this project was meant to be free and open. So it's a if you don't know what a, what RPGs is, it's basically a toolkit for uh, building fantasy a fantasy setting, and the way we you we uh, we we did it is. Uh, to uh, produce an empty map 
you have it here in a various uh, stage but basically it's a, it's an empty map and we uh, we casted a grid on it and then we start to uh, to feel to, to, to fill these uh, these grid these X's and uh, start to make up nations so by this process you can start over and create your own world with just this map and forget all about what's in your, what's written in the book you have a nation sheet over here I will just go back a little bit yeah so you have uh, you can photocopy or print these uh, these page and you just follow instructions the instructions are here in page 58 make your own nations so you just have to follow 10 easy steps and you will have the, the, the foundation for your nation and now you just have to expand on it so it's just the beginning uh, so you have here uh, random random tables for common encounters and more fantastical encounters all the hundreds and you have a special encounter here and random nations and random races we tried to make it as possible uh, as generic and as accessible as possible so the book is filled with uh, the creation of all the collaborators and I will take the time here to name every nation so you will have uh, nations like uh, Anoran, the Stone, Stone Kingdom, my, uh, my own creation. Then you have Apotic, the Iron Sun, created by uh, Mario Russo. Then you have the Ketonic Empire by uh, Robert R. Waldo, or RRW. Then you have Kokra, uh, the Compendium of War by Virginie Filto. Lazette. The Old Kingdom by Anthony Boyd, our rune slingers. <laughs> uh, Logar, the insular city, uh, city states. By <laughs> I will have to refresh <laughs> my memory. Sorry uh, if I forget your name. Yeah, Johan Johannes uh, Heinloff. Uh, Nakaroth. Nakaroth. The Alliance Imperium by Frédéric de Foix. Quilvan by John O'Connor. The Grand Duchy of Rukal by Christopher Jeffrey. The Rotang Empire by uh, Tim Harper, aka Sam Wise 7, that several people will, will recognize from the RPG Brigade. The Samakian Kingdom by Eric Latouche. The Sundark Lands by Ragith Saba. Taltish, the Northern Light by Kate Hershey Jr. Hello, Kate. <laughs> uh, Trifendry, Torn Land of Magic by François Letarte. And then you have Unknown Regions. So this book can help you create your own fantasy setting. I hope this book serves many purposes. Purpose. Like, uh, for example, if you are uh, running a one-shot of D&D, Pathfinder, GURPS Fantasy, Basic BRP, Rollmaster, uh, you can use any system because it is system neutral. So if you are running, for example, a one-shot, you can easily run it by picking up a nation and just run it into it. You could use RPGS for the foundation of your next campaign. You could use the setting for the creation of your own RPG. And finally, I hope you could use this book or this PDF as a source of information as just 
a good um, treasure trove of inspiring ideas. So thanks for watching this and uh, if you want to buy this book it will be possible uh, soon, very soon. And I may um, post it uh, on the RPG Brigade Facebook page or in this video's uh, notes. Um, since it's a collective um, this is meant to be an open project and a free project. So if you are willing to buy these two books or, or one of, uh, version of these books you will just pay for the print that means what uh, lulu.com needs to produce the book and you pay for the shipping and that's it. Nobody will take a cent from you uh, just uh, for making these, uh, these products. So uh, thank you for watching it and uh, may you use RPGS in your future game and uh, if it can just help you one minute it will, it will be well worth it. Thank you.